Being able to carry things by bike is really empowering and since I've recently acquired a trailer I feel like I've got a pickup truck now and I, I feel like I can carry anything on a bike. I, I used to commute to school when I actually had a different bike, I didn't have a basket on the back. My biggest dislike about it was that I would get sweaty by the time I arrived by having something kind of suffocating my back. I love having it just on my bike behind me, not having to think about it. In the first month, I was just carrying my, my bag like this on my shoulder, and it's not very nice to bike like this, and then grocery bags on the handlebar. So now I just put it there and don't think about it. If you want to stop somewhere quickly and run in and get something, difficult in the car, but if you're on a bike, it's very easy. You just stop and you pick up whatever you want to pick up, that avocado, throw it in your pannier, and then you're off. I think the most essential tool is a good, comfortable way to carry something. Uh, whether that's a backpack, messenger bag, basket, cargo bike, trailer, it's really kind of a matter of personal preference. The basket is very nice because you don't need anything extra just to put your stuff. What I would recommend if you have your bag is to put this around the handlebar when you are biking because then, yeah, no one can just grab it and, and go somewhere. The most invaluable thing are the panniers. I can carry two shopping bags of groceries very easily. They're also waterproof. Let's go. You ready to go? Okay, you ready for your lift? And I also have a rack on the back of my bike. I need for the, the dog's basket. Good boy. There's no perfect way for everybody. There's just what's best for you. The first thing I would say is start small. On your way home, stop at a store and pick up a, a sandwich, and, and then uh, you, know, you can work up from there. Just packing up your stuff well, making sure that nothing's going to slip out or move around in whatever rig you're, you're using is a good strategy. I carry plates and glasses, things that can break, so um, just packing smart and making sure everything is attached properly is a good idea. I've always been inspired by people in other countries that carry amazing loads on their bikes that are stacked six feet high or they're carrying like four people and I figure if people can do that on equipment that's you know technically pretty basic bikes that are really heavy um, then we can do that here too. I have carried about 300 pounds on a bike and it was for a catering job where I brought in an induction burner and some iron pots and food and drink. If I'm going to work, I carry a bunch of papers and my swimsuit. Mostly just my, my bag with all the crap that is in it, but sometimes also grocery shopping. Tools sometimes. My backpack and laptop. I'll carry like a sweatshirt, a couple pens. I also carry my massage table on bike because I'm a massage therapist that does house calls. Well, you can carry all kinds of things on your bicycle. You just have to be creative. Sky's the limit. <laughs> <laughs>